Uh, hey, Dijon, congrats on the win. Now that the season is done with, how much do you guys think you've improved from day one to now, finishing things out with three wins? Uh, I think we improved a lot. You know, we started off real bad. You know, we still, we didn't do as well as we wanted, but we all kept kept grinding it out, coming to practice every day hard and lifting weights hard. So I feel like we got a lot better. Only time will tell how much better we'll get. <laughs> What are your thoughts on the Big 12 tournament? What do you think you guys can do up in Kansas City? Uh, I think we could win the whole thing. As long as we come and play our game and play basketball the way we play and play tough, how we've been playing, then I think we can beat everybody. You guys played pretty much exclusively four guards around either uh, Casey or Davion today. How do you think that went? Did it open up anything for the offense going four guards the whole way? Uh, I think it kind of opened up the paint a little bit, you know, get, get guys uh, open shots because guys got to um, penetrate and kick. So I think it went out pretty well today for that. Thanks, Dishwan. No problem. Okay, next question to Tim Fitzgerald. Hey, Dejuan, congratulations on the win. Um, you. You, you won three out of four here down the stretch. How much better is this team right now? Uh, we're a lot better than when, when we started. You know, we all clicking together. We gelling, everybody playing harder than they play. We're finally making a little bit of shots, you know. We started off not making, like, no shots at all, but we're finally making a, some shots. We're still not making the ones we really need. But, you know, I think we got a lot better than where we started. And, you know, the sky's the limit. Uh, how, uh, how good has this been for you and the rest of the team mentally to, to get some reward after this long season? Uh, it's, it's been well, you know, starting to win, winning more, win more. It's just been helping everybody, giving everybody confidence and, you know, letting everybody know we got a chance. Everybody on the team think we got a chance. The coaches believe in us every day. So it feel like, make us feel like we have a chance to win. What's Coach Weber been like through this process? Uh, he's been the same as he's been since the first day, you know, coach hard and just want to win. Every, want everybody to play as hard as they can and, Want the best for them. Thanks, Stage One. Appreciate it. Uh, next question to Michael Goins. Yeah, Stage One, where do you feel like your game is at right now? Can you repeat that again, please? Where do you feel like your game is at right now? Uh, I don't. Right now, I don't think I'm as good as I'll ever be. Right now, you know, I feel like I'm just. You know, the, the sky's the limit. I feel like I continue to keep working. I'm going to keep getting better and better and better. I stay in the gym. You know, only time would tell, show everybody how what I'm really about. You put up some pretty good numbers today with just 21 minutes. Uh, was Coach kind of open your injury? Can can heal a little bit with uh, limiting your minutes? Uh, today, it wasn't nothing about the, in, the injury. You know, I'm, I'm going to play through that no matter what. It was about uh, the fouls. I had I got two fouls with about probably about seven minutes left, and I come in and get another cheap foul, <laughs> and then I sit for a long time, you know. So it was just about the fouls today. Nothing, nothing about the injury. Uh, I'm doing staying in treatment, doing well with with Luke Saber, our trainer. He helped me a lot, you know. So and just a little more information on how you're feeling right now. Uh, I'm just I'm happy. I'm happy to win. You know, it's. We've been we had a long hard season of losing and ups ups and downs, but you know we can only go up from here. You know we only been winning and it it's, it make everybody happy. You guys seem to hit some shots early. It was the offense kind of uh, in a pretty good pretty good flow there in the early going. Uh yeah, it's been in a pretty good flow. You know I've been I've been in the gym late nights, late nights working on my game, getting up shots with the managers. They've been helping me out. You know talking to people about my jump shot, things like that, just trying to get better and make shots. And I feel like today I, it showed a little bit. You know, I didn't make all the shots I wanted to shoot, but it showed a little bit today from showing my, the work I've been working on. And what was your take on Stelton Miguel's performance today? Um, he played played pretty well. You know, he guarded, he guarded, pressured everybody. He could really guard. And today he showed, today he showed like he can really pass now. You know, seven assists, that's big. That's big for a guy that, that's his size and, you know, who don't have the ball in his hands that much. But today he got the ball a lot because he was already doing a good job. And today he was big, big time today.
Thank you, Deshwan. Appreciate it. Next question to Kellis Robinette. Hey, just one, one more for you. This was the closest thing you guys have had to like a drama free victory, let it halftime, really never let them totally get back into it. How good did that feel? Uh, felt well. Be able to um, keep a team down and don't let them come back. And then we got the pressure on us because they came back and we already had a lead. So it just felt well, you know, everybody just keep grinding out. We, don't, we won't have any pressure on us. Just it felt well, though. Well, congrats again. Thank you.